Well, as we told you earlier, the Panama Canal is the gateway to South America for many a U.S. farm product. Standing by at the Twilight Studios in Baton Rouge is Kristen Oates with this week's Ag Minute. Kristen, how are you? I'm great, Mike. And while we're holding down the fort here in Baton Rouge, I must say that I'm a little bit jealous of all the beautiful sights you've seen in South America, especially one of the world's greatest engineering projects, the Panama Canal. named one of the seven modern wonders of the world. The Panama Canal was one of the largest and most difficult projects to construct, but it made a major impact on shipping between the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans. In the 16th century, Charles V wanted a new route to ease the voyage for ships traveling to and from Peru and Spain, as well as give the Spanish a military edge over the Portuguese. In 1881, the French began to dig the 102-mile canal, but rain-induced landslides and widespread disease caused the death of more than 21,000 workers, and the French abandoned the project. In 1904, Americans took over the construction of the canal and finished it 10 years later. The first ship passed through the 48-mile canal on August 14, 1914. Last year, more than 14,000 vessels traveled through the waterway, and today, the Panama Canal continues to be a key factor in world shipping. And they're actually adding another canal to the waterway to make it 33% larger. Now moving on to Twyla Trivia. Last week we asked you, which plant is historically associated with the Easter holiday? And surprisingly, while most of you guessed tulips, the actual answer is dogwood. For this week's question, who was considered the mastermind behind the Panama Canal? Was it A, Theodore Roosevelt, B, John Stevens, or C, Charles V? Log on to our website, twilatv.org, submit your answer, and we'll send one lucky winner the usual Twyla prize pack. And Mike, I can't wait till you get back to hear all of your tall tales about your adventures. Kristen Oaks, thanks. When we come back, some final notes on our trip here to South America. Stay with us. <music> 